Hey guys, USA Teens today. Welcome back. We're going to make this real quick. This is just a quick mathematics problem. One question only. So, mathematics tip. This is a tip on how to solve a semi-difficult mathematical word problem. So here we go, problem number one. It takes five days for six ospreys to drink a small lake full of water. If four more ospreys were added to the population, how many hours would it take for them to drink all the water in the lake? And hint, what you should be looking at right now is five days, six, four more ospreys were added to the population. Remember, Eventually, you're going to have to convert days to hours or hours to days. But let me put why I have this sentence here. You must convert days to hours because the question asks you how many hours is because right here at the last sentence, how many hours would it take for them to drink all the water in the lake? So the answer is going to be in hours. Okay. Five days for six ospreys, the beginning of the set up equation. Please make sure you read this carefully. Four more ospreys. It does not say four ospreys. It says four more than were originally there. So you know you have to add plus four. Here's a setup for the first part of the equation. That then becomes six ospreys, top part, nominator. Denominators five days equals six ospreys plus four more ospreys. Number of days, any variable converted into hours. So make sure you get that. Convert the days into hours, five days times 24. Why are we doing 24? Because there are 24 hours in one day. It asks you hours, not days. 24 hours times five days is 124 120 hours excuse me now set the conversion ratio here six ospreys over 120 hours equals six ospreys plus four more ospreys over x you can use x y z b whatever whichever variable you want Six ospreys, 120 hours. Six ospreys plus four more ospreys. That's going to give you 10, so let's get to it. Make sure all these ratios was in part of step five is equation. Make sure they equal. Six ospreys equals 10 ospreys. Make sure you don't ch change that around. 120 hours equals X hours. That's the number of hours you need to find out. So let's cross multiply. Six ospreys, X equals 10. You don't even have to do the math on this. You can do a mental math. 120 times 10, just add an extra zero. Six X equals 12. Hey guys, 20 times six would be 120. So six times 200 would be here, right? 200 hours. So that's the answer to your question. If you want to know if you're checking on yourself, if you want to convert back to days, remember that you would have 8.33 days, which is actually eight and a third days. So you'd have X equals 200 hours. You would just divide it out. You can always go back and check to make sure something is working the way that you want it to. Make sure things are right. Hey, guys, that's a quick tip. If you want to pause and stop this video, we're all done. Have a good day.